And looking specifically at the positivity rate in Sarasota County, the director of the county's health department says he feels good about the reopening of schools. But what happens if a student or teacher tests positive for COVID? 10 Tampa Bay reporter Leah Fernandez walks us through the school district's plan. We've developed an online form that feeds into a database that all staff and students will be tracked on. The school district of Sarasota hopes their strict COVID-19 plans and procedures will keep this virus from spreading through their schools. If you're sending your child back to the classroom, all parents have to sign this form, promising to take their child's temperature and check for COVID symptoms each morning. We're going to provide a list of common COVID-19 symptoms and we're going to ask parents, please, if your student is experiencing any of these symptoms, don't put them on a bus, don't bring them to the bus stop, don't bring them to school. That's our first line of defense. If we do have a situation on campus where a student presents symptoms similar to COVID, we will bring that student to the clinic and isolate them. That student would then have to stay home for 10 days. Same goes for a teacher. You cannot return back to school unless you go and get a, a test, a negative test that would allow you to come back earlier than 10 days, or you go to your doctor and you get a alternative diagnosis. If you are sick, once that 10 day window expires, before you can go back, you have to get a letter from the health department clearing you to return to school or work. It's only when a positive COVID-19 test is reported that contact tracing begins. If it turns out that we have a positive diagnosis, then the Department of Health, the administrative offices of the school district, the landings, and the school site will work quickly and thoroughly to notify families or anyone that is at risk. If you are the COVID positive case, you'll need to self-isolate for 10 days since the date of the test or since the start of symptoms. If you are a student or teacher who came in contact with a positive case, you'll have to quarantine for 14 days. And in that instance, if you tested positive or were identified as coming in contact with that person, there's no way to get back to school any sooner. You have to stay out the full 10 or 14 days. And even after that, you'll still need to get clearance from the health department before you can return to school.